Now everybody, before I get into the topic at hand, please go down below into the description box and like the Facebook fan page that I created for you guys. It already passed 50 likes, which is crazy to me because I was not actually expecting that many likes in the first week. But of course, you guys, the SOS family is already trying to take over everywhere, as well as Instagram, which is at 599 followers. So somebody go over there, make an account, and help me pass 600. Now, last but not least, I actually created my fashion channel. There's no videos up there yet, but for those of you guys who are into men's care, into clothing, blah, 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 go to the description down below. Make sure you go subscribe there, and I'll be uploading videos shortly, starting off with my hair care routine. I'll explain what I'm going to be doing with my hair on that channel, of course. Oh, yeah, and for those of you guys who have Snapchat, you guys can add me on Snapchat at Simon T. Lendor. My name is also on the screen. It's just like the Instagram link. So go ahead and add me on Snapchat. I posted a video on Instagram, and I posted a long Snapchat story on Snapchat. So, yeah, let's take, let's take over everything. Let's take over everything, guys. Now, what you guys are really here for. The no fab challenge. Did I survive? How long did I last? How many times have I failed? Well, did I survive? No. How long did I last? Hmm. Hmm. Three days? Probably? Yeah, I failed miserably. Miserably. Like, dang. I, I, I was like going well. I was kind of confident. I was like, man, I lasted three days. And then I wasn't doing anything. I was bored. And I was like, you know what? Doing it one time won't matter. And then the second time came, I'm like, well, you know what? It's just two times. Is there anything wrong with doing it twice? Hey, twice in a month, that's good. Then the tenth time came, I said, you know what? It's just ten times. It's only two hands. Like, imagine if it was three hands. And then the fifteenth time came, I'm like, you know what? It's normal anyway. Like, is it really bad to not do it? That's exactly how I just failed over and over and over. I realized that for me, if I actually want to stop doing it, because I'm not addicted to it, guys. I, I know some of you guys, probably a, a few of you guys are actually addicted to it, or you, you guys just don't care, you, you like doing it, right? For me, I feel like when I'm actually productive, no, not like, not I feel like, when I'm actually productive, I don't do it. In fact, I don't even think about doing it. Again, I'm not addicted to it, but the only time I actually ever do it is when I'm bored. I ne I'm never like outside chilling with friends or doing whatever and thinking about doing it. Like, it's not like an addiction. So basically for some of you guys out there who are actually going forth and doing this challenge for like indefinitely or for a month or three months, the best bet for you is to Make sure you're productive and trying to achieve a goal or something. You know, even if you're just playing games at least, play a game. If you're done playing the game and you're bored, go do something. Go work out or something. Clean the house, tidy up your room, because I know some of you nasty mofos out there who watch my videos have a nasty ass room. Well, I, I can, my room's kind of messy, but it's nothing really, it's nothing really. Anyway, my point is, is being productive is the best way to stop doing it, because when you're idle, when you're doing nothing, that is when you're most tempted to do it. And I'm speaking to those of you guys who actually don't want to do it. For those of you guys who don't, who don't care, you're like, hey, I'm bored, I'm just gonna beat my meat. Well, then this ain't for you, you don't really care. But again, I failed miserably, I had all the excuses in the world, and I just, I will end up stopping. Like once I start my job, most likely I won't even be doing it. I won't be doing it, I'll be tired, and like when I start my job, I'll either be working out in the morning, and at night I'll be trying to answer comments that you guys leave on my videos, and I'll be going to sleep, I'll be eating, you know, trying to get that, get the, the gains in, get my calories in and whatnot. I don't have time to be, right? I don't have time for all that stuff. So basically, yeah, I'm good. To be honest, I have no addiction. I can stop if I want to. All I gotta do is be productive. And once I start my job, July 14th, uh, yeah, and bodybuilding with calisthenics, yo, know, that wouldn't even be a thought in my mind. So again, good luck to all of you guys out there who are actually participating in the No Fat Challenge. I hope you guys are successful. I know it's hard, but the power is within you, okay? Just believe in yourself. Done.